It is time to unlock Willow. Now, since her sneak peeks, Supercell actually went and gave her a bunch of buffs, and a bunch of people have been asking me whether or not she's actually worth upgrading, unlocking, how strong is she going to be? So today's video is honestly all about finding out exactly that. Is she worth unlocking over other mythic brawlers or even other brawlers? And is she actually worth upgrading and spending your resources on? Well, we're gonna find out because Willow is unlocked. Lovable? Maybe. Frightening? Without a doubt. Controlling? 100%. So pin pack, got some pins for her. All this is gonna go towards fame anyway, so I might as well at least just unlock the resources. Then we're gonna completely max out Willow to see how strong she is. We're gonna unlock her gadget and her star power, as well as each of the gears. Oh, and I realized I can actually get to lunar fame, so let's, uh, let's do that right now. That should be it, right there, boom. Lunar fame. <laughs> Wasn't planning on that, but that's exciting. Let's go. Now that Will is maxed out, I'm actually going to play her in the Unlimited Tries Challenge. This will all be against randoms, but it doesn't matter if we lose because everybody gets unlimited lives. After we do that, I'm going to rank her in four different categories. Damage, utility, survivability, and how easy is she yet to actually use. Hopefully after this, you guys will have a good idea of whether or not she's un worth unlocking, upgrading, and playing. First up is Gem Grab. Now, one of the interesting buffs that they did to her is they made it so that her first damage would actually appear as soon as it actually land so like you don't have to wait for it. so that's actually really huge for her and uh, we'll see if I can even hit people now also her star power is really strong because it make it decreases enemy reload speed if they are taking poison damage her range is not very far like there's okay am I actually gonna be able to deal any damage to this other willow we're both playing a little bit too uh, too passively Oh, we're going to deal some damage to the BB now. So BB's reload speed is decreased right now because I'm actually dealing damage to her. Oh, looks like Dynamite got a stun on him. And the enemy Willow is just paying really close attention here. So she's actually going to be really difficult to deal with. She's playing pretty well. But we're going to deal some damage right here. The damage does happen over time. Okay, let's see if we can do something with this, this BB here. Um, nope. Nope, no, there, was, there was nothing we could do there. <laughs> but the BB's like freaking out afterwards. What I should have done is just wasted BB's ammo, actually. I didn't actually know how long it would take for her, her super would last. I actually did not know that. Uh, well, I landed a super. Is there anything? There's no indication, I don't think. You just have to kind of get used to it, I guess. Okay, we got a new pin, or... Yeah, there we go. Oh, I already had it, so we got gold. <laughs> Much less exciting on this account than my free-to-play account. <laughs> also, I realized, can I get another pin pack? Oh, yeah, we got some some pins for Willow and Gray. Cool. Oh, and that was my last Gray pin. Sweet. Surprise, surprise, we're up against another Willow. <laughs> I have a feeling that's going to happen a lot today. <laughs> now, one thing I did not do in the last match was actually even just use her gadget. So what it does is it deals all the damage in one hit and adds an additional 500 damage. Oh, we got some poison there. Very good. So I'm just going to put that down. I did not hit her, actually, so it doesn't actually do anything. Okay, Dynamite. Okay, we're facing off against another thrower, so that's interesting. Let's see here. Doing some damage to BB. They're, they're falling back. Haha. -ha. Oh, oh, my guy's actually, like, in trouble. Okay, well, that was interesting. <laughs> I uh, did something with Dynamite, but I did it in, like, the worst spot that I could have. Okay, so that Brock is not underneath their control. Let's grab Dinah, and we're gonna just attack our own person. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't, like, even dealt damage with it, but it is very interesting. I don't even know what to think about it yet. I know that one of the buffs they actually did with Willow since actually releasing her before, you could not score when you're controlling an enemy brawler in, like, Brawl Ball. So we're gonna see that, hopefully. I don't know. I mean, I've, I've not been able to really use her super at all. And of course, I'm not getting star player because she doesn't do very much damage. Okay, I'm next for playing her in heist. And I don't know, at least this map, I would not recommend playing her. So this is actually going to be interesting. Um, we are doing a little bit of damage to that Edgar, so that's good. Let's uh, come up over here. Dynamite is... Oh, actually, Dynamite is going to kill me. Nope, actually, I'm going to kill Dynamite. That's perfect. Okay, we'll deal damage right here. Can I... Uh, I can kill that bee. Very good. Okay, I dealt all my damage with the gadget. That's actually a lot of damage. That's like almost 3,000 damage with a single hit. That's crazy. Okay, we'll play defense on this Edgar here. Ugh, okay, Edgar's down. Uh, you tried to use my gadget, didn't hit. Okay, oh, okay, the dynamite is gonna fall, but there, Edgar's there, and then we win. Okay, interesting. Ah, uh, I don't know, her super's weird. We got some more credits, which are gonna go directly to fame. Okay, now we're facing off against, oh wow, they've got a Martian fame. That is not easy to get right now. I just got Lunar because I've mostly, honestly, just been playing my free-to-play series, but Martian fame, that takes a lot to get to, so that's actually pretty cool. Um, okay, let's see here. I'm doing a little bit of damage. I don't know where they're at, but there's lots of walls for me to stay safe behind here. Okay, now we got rid of the Willow. Let's uh, go deal some damage to this enemy safe here. And now we deal damage to this, but it's gonna take a long time, dude. Her reload speed is so slow. 
Man, interesting. Okay, let's come up over here, deal some more damage. There's somebody in this bush. It's Tick. Um, I'm just going to attack their Jesse. Okay, that was weird. <laughs> but now Tick doesn't have ammo, so it like works. Oh, I'm gonna die to this Tick. There's there's no way that I can... Oh, actually... Oh, I actually did pretty good. Okay, but who's de doing damage to our safe? It's the enemy Willow. Of course it is. Okay, but we win. It doesn't matter. I, I'm str I want to use her super in a way that's actually good. Like, so far I've like wasted ammo and almost dealt damage, almost. But I, I wanna get like one really good use out of it. Okay, up next we got Bounty, and I'm not convinced that she's gonna be super great for Bounty. Uh, we'll have to see though. The damage over the over time just like isn't that amazing. But we do have a little bit of area control, so like maybe we can do that. Like I just did hit somebody. We'll come put that attack right there and just wait. Like she's kind of like Tick in the sense that she's a little bit more about control, a little bit. I, I mean, she is, she's a controller. That's what her name is. Okay, we got rid of him, very nice. He was a little bit too greedy, so it makes sense. It's not like we necessarily like played super great there. He just he just didn't play very great. <laughs> uh, we're actually like really not doing very good here. I can kill the spike though. I just hit him, so spike is going to die. The nice thing though is that he died while I was dead, so my bounty didn't increase, but I got all the points for killing him, which actually gives me an advantage. So that's kind of cool. There's only a few other brawlers that can do that. They're all like poison brawlers or like it, on the off chance that like every now and then, oh, can we just kill her? That should, that's enough. That's enough to kill the Eve, sweet. Okay. Oh, I died, I died. I was like, I, I actually did something, but then I died. So it wasn't actually something. It was actually very bad. Um, I don't know if we can come back from this. Oh, actually, we might be able to. Come on, I dealt damage to the spike, and I would have I would have killed the spike, but I didn't because it was damage over time, so that's unfortunate. Okay, so we had our first loss, but you know what? That's the, the cool thing about this challenge is I can just go over and over and over again, and I still feel like I'm learning a little bit more about how strong Willow is. Like, we want to know how good she is and in, in what situation she's not very good in, so this is actually really perfect. Okay, but uh, we've got a Sam. Oh, we're going to prevent Sam from getting over to his knuckle busters, or at least kind of. Oh, dude, his healing is so annoying like I can't I can't out damage him I can't I know where he's going because he throws his knuckle busters over there all he's doing is just charging my super okay and now I'm, I'm using him to attack his own enemies come on come on come on die okay thank you I got him I actually like deal damage but I, he didn't have enough ammo to actually kill anybody so like we definitely want to put that down right there this, see this Sam, he's recharging all over the place, but the thing is, is he's also just charging our supers. Come on. Oh, I, so, oh, I did get him. Sweet. Okay, but now I've got my super. God, this Sam's so annoying. It doesn't even matter though. Okay, I used him. I'm running him over here. I'm wasting his ammo. He just, I just wasted his ammo. That's literally all I did. That's, I just put him into a bad spot. Oh, but I did die. Oh, no. That's exactly what they needed. It doesn't matter. I actually killed him after I died, and we got the points. We got the blue star, so we got a win. Oh, she's so weird. I just don't know what to think of her yet. We still got some more matches, though. I was not star player, though. We still have not been star player a single time. But, like, against this dynamite here... Oh, is that going to kill the dynamite? I did actually kill the dynamite. I think only because somebody else still damage. I mean, her range definitely is not as far as, like, Ticks is um, or Sprouts. Uh, but like dynamite and barley, I don't know. It's, it's kind of close. Wow. We could not kill that tick head Okay. Oh, I'm just like using dynamite to like attack my own enemies here. Oh, okay. That was interesting Um, but I didn't hit anybody, but maybe I should have done a better job at aiming uh, It's hard when they were kind of bunched up like that actually. Uh, okay. Let's see if we can actually use our super here and get um, a victory I did kill the dynamite, but the dynamite killed me. I latched on the gray, killed him, but then I died anyway. So, uh, I don't know. Okay, we're facing up against a bull and an RT, which I'm actually excited about because if I can use my super against either one of them, that could work out pretty well. Dude, dealing with dynamite, she struggles against dynamite because dynamite can deal his damage instantly, whereas she has to deal poison damage. She's actually a little rough against him. Okay, but that bull did underestimate me, which is actually kind of nice. Like, I don't know, but a skilled player is not going to do that. A skilled player is going to pay attention to how many ticks of damage they're taking and stuff like that. See, I, I, using her super is so weird. Like, I got onto the RT and I was like, cool, now I'm in control of somebody else. But you can't use her if you're going to be vulnerable. So it's weird. Oh, that's actually enough points for us to get the victory here. Don't die. To, you died to the 
<laughs> she struggles against Dynamite. Dynamite really counters her, so she's not OP. Okay, so this time we're not actually facing off against any throwers. We are facing against a squeak, though, and the squeak will be able to actually hit around the other side of walls, so that's that's kind of good. Her attacks have such a long... Oh, come on, guys. Come on. Like, I could barely hit that surge. Okay. Let's actually block shots. Oh, that actually worked. That was like the first time I used her super and it actually worked well. I used Squeak to body block for me. That's what you need to do. That is very interesting. Okay, okay. So bot so, so you have to use the, the person you attack to body block. So she's actually going to be good against single target damage dealers like um, Surge. Okay, okay. Okay, we're dealing damage. Dude, that, that worked out great. That was the second time it worked out great. Oh, and now that Sturge is gonna die. That's awesome. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'm so glad I figured that out. Oh, the tick didn't need help saving. Oh, he's so good. Okay. We just need to not be stupid heads. That's right. <laughs> not be stupid heads. That could be the, one of the lamest things I've ever said on my channel. <laughs> We're gonna throw that down with the gadget. I actually really like her gadget. I haven't been using it a ton, but I really like it when I have been able to use it. Hit, hit the squeak. The squeak is dead. That's awesome. And Surge can't do anything because I got my super. Oh, that was the first time she was useful, and I got the star player! The nice thing about Willow's attacks is they have to fall back and actually heal. I can't- I can't take care of them, though. I should- I mean, I could've used the gadget, but it wouldn't have been enough damage. Oh, uh, yeah, we just got wrecked. We got wrecked so hard, it wasn't even funny. But we did get a new Willow spray, so that's cool. Oh, oh, and there we go, Axel Willow! Okay, sweet, we got the- we got the skin. <laughs> we did gain something important from that- that, uh, match, so that's- that's nice. Okay, this matchup should be a little bit more- in Oh, we got a tick on our team, so we have two throwers that- ugh. Okay. I mean, I'm, I can't be upset at the tick. Here I am playing Willow here, and we don't even know how good she is in this challenge, so this will be uh, interesting, I guess. Let's deal some damage to that Surge. The Surge is nice and slow, so we should deal actually quite a bit of damage against him. Okay. We got him falling back here. Dealing damage to the bull. Oh, boy. Oh, why did I do that? No, I, I, I legit had an opportunity to actually make that goal. She's actually really dangerous in Brawl Ball. In that situation, all I had to do was just aim on that surge and actually like not be an idiot and uh and i actually would have crushed it she's really good on offense not very good on defense okay did i hit him twice he might die i did do that so great she's like she is deadly she really is she you do not want to underestimate her okay <laughs> <laughs> oh, but I died. How? I wasn't even paying attention. I was just so excited that I got to kill his bull as the enemy bull. <laughs> Your super it takes a lot to figure out. I don't know all the times to use it, actually. I really do not. So you need to use her, her super on, like, a long-range brawler who's kind of far away, I say, right as I go in there and try and deal with this. <laughs> that, that was actually awesome. That worked out incredibly well. Come on, Jackie. There we go. Okay. That was really a great play. That was probably my first actually good play using a Willow Super <laughs> this entire time. Actually, no, that was the second one. The last match actually was awesome. And we got 150 credits. Flex, flex. Okay, this is our last matchup. We're facing off against Crow, another Poison Brawler, plus Frank and Max. So this is going to be interesting. She's going to be pretty hard to actually uh, hit her shots on against this Max. Oh, I missed him? I was literally, like, right there. He's so big. How did I miss him? Okay, so our super is really narrow. You you have to be pretty precise with it. Honestly, it's it's actually got a pretty short range. Her super range is really short. Oh, I'm realizing she's good on defense because she can literally just control the ball. Like, if somebody has the ball and they're going to score a goal and she has her super, all she has to do... Oh, let's deal with this crow here. Okay. Okay, oh, that was interesting. But all she has to do is use a super on them, and then they can't score because, you know, anyway, I don't know. She's she's interesting. And I'm going to score. There we go. I scored with their opponent. That's cool. <laughs> that is, like, really cool. Okay, let's see here. All we got to do is defend now, and it should be, you know what? I'm doing it. No, Crow. No. Oh, why am I doing this? I'm just going to. Oh, that was actually really scary. Why did I do that? Oh, there's so many things to think about. Like, I should have just ran up and wasted Frank's attack so he wouldn't have had any attacks to actually hit me with. So, I don't know. Inter interesting. But that is the challenge. We won 1,000 gold. And more important, the good random spray, which I actually like. Now we got the good randoms and the bad random spray. <laughs> okay, I'm starting to feel like I really understand where Willow's at, but I still want to play her a little bit more. So, I'm going to play her in Club League. Now, we are in Masters, so this is going to be fairly competitive. And this should help me kind of finalize my thoughts on her. First up, Bounty, nowhere to hide. This is probably not going to be the best map for her. <laughs> okay, she did not 
get banned, which is really nice. My teammate's gonna pick Willow and I'm going to pick Spike because that's who he wants to play. And then we're going to swap. Perfect. Okay, a Mandy, a Gale, and a Leon. My goal, honestly, is to charge up my super and then use it against the Leon. So we'll see how well that actually works out. Place that right there. Oh, that actually worked out. The gadget came in clutch. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, that was so great. The gadget came in clutch again. Oh, that's so awesome. Now I can kind of play a little bit defensively back here with my teammates. And then if a Leon jumps on us or something like that, um, then we should be able to use our super on him and it actually just completely prevent his push from happening. Oh, that sucked. Okay, that was actually really awesome. <laughs> the fact that she hit both of us with that super is actually pretty cool. I'm pretty... Oh! Oh my gosh! I I love this enemy Mandy. She did she did so good. <laughs> okay, we gotta be a little bit more careful now that we've got this Mandy here who's like a a destruction bot. Okay, let's put this right here. Dude, she is trapped. I missed the super, doesn't matter. Okay, we're good. Interesting, interesting. Okay, we got the win. Um we got another match to go though. Okay, I think the Mandy is just going okay, there's the Leon. Okay, boom. Dude, that gadget is great. That gadget really comes in clutch for situations like that. Okay, I, I mean, I did something with it. I, you know what's kind of funny? I think that the Leon thought that that Gale that I was controlling was being toxic and attacking him. I, I don't know if he was actually. I, th I, I don't know. I don't know. It's hard to say because he's now AFK. Oh, I missed. Dang it. <laughs> oh, her, her super is really hard to hit. It should be. It should not be easy. It really should not be. Yeah, her, her super should be hard to hit, and it is hard to hit. And it's also a really short range, so I don't know. Okay, next we got Hard Rock Mine for Gem Grab. I actually kind of like her on this map, I think. Ooh, interesting. Rico and two assassins. I don't know how I feel about this. She does kind of counter assassins if she has her super up, but otherwise she really doesn't. She's like semi-weak to assassins. I'm um, dealing damage to the Rico, so the Rico is not realizing that I'm a thrower apparently or something got rid of him so that's cool we're op completely opening this map up it's actually really good this Rico's not um he's not the challenge I was hoping that he would be <laughs> um Okay, interesting. I did something. Every single time that I use her super and I actually hit somebody, my brain just pauses and I'm like, what am I supposed to do here? I don't know. Okay. Uh, that was interesting. I, I just don't know what to do with it. Uh, okay. Oh, I didn't even have any gems, so I could have died. Uh, we got a win right there. I don't know. Okay, facing off against this Rico here. Let's see if he does a little bit better. Gives me a little bit more of a challenge. Oh, I'm lagging. So far, not a challenge. I am literally connected with an ethernet cable, so this lag is the server. <laughs> I'm just spam attacking here. Hopefully we can hit somebody. Oh, I'm actually taking damage. I died. <laughs> Took me about a minute and a half to get from spawn to, uh, I, I thought I was at the gem mine. Apparently I'm not. <laughs> okay, now I am? I don't know. Oh, everybody's zipping around like crazy. Whoa! Um, what happened? It says, you've been suspended from leaving too many club league power matches? I literally just, what? <laughs> I'm suspended for five minutes. I can't even play. By the way, we did win here. So I, I guess, I, I guess we're counting it as a win. I wasn't star player, that's for sure. Okay, gem grab a cute angle. I actually like this one. Teammate selected Willow. I'm gonna swap with them and we're set. Let's see, we got a Janet over here. I'd really like to be where that Janet's at. Uh, I don't have the range to really push her back safely. Honestly, I do not. Yeah, like I had to overextend myself a little bit. Okay, but now she should die. So that's actually perfect. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> but I actually do a, little, a lot of damage. Look at that. They pulled me and I hit all, I hit two of them with an attack. So that's actually really good. Okay, I'm dealing damage. There we go. That was a pretty good super, actually. Okay. Oh, I'm killing this. Okay, the gene is dead. There's a lot of big choke points here that my attacks work very well in. Okay, but gene's gonna try and charge up a super. Uh, I wouldn't. I missed, but it's fine. It's actually perfectly fine because gene's just gonna die right here. Sandy's gonna try and pick up all those gems. I'm gonna deal damage to the Sandy. This was a great map for Willow. That was, this is actually a really good map for her. Oh dude, playing Willow with B is actually fantastic because those slows come in super clutch. Like look at that, that's such a massive choke, choke point that I can attack. Oh, I missed? Dude, her super range is so, <laughs> the width is so small. Okay, we've got the countdown. We're just dealing damage to Gene here. Come on. 
Okay, I'm picking up all this. And we're still good. I, wow, she's interesting. And I got star player. Okay, let's talk about how strong she is. And then I'll talk about whether you should unlock her, upgrade her, or even bother even using her. Despite the fact that I had a 76% win rate, I don't actually think that she's crazy strong, but I do think that she's a bit above average. For her damage score, I'm gonna give her a seven out of 10. Honestly, once people think figure out her range, I think they're gonna have a pretty good time just like staying away from her. And I think a lot of my wins today were because people just didn't recognize how strong she could be and they didn't really fully understand how to play against her. There are going to be some maps with lots of walls that can protect her that she's going to be very good. And her damage is good though, okay? I'd like to compare her to like Byron who deals 1,530 total damage for every single attack that he lands. She deals 1,800 damage, which is 18% more than Byron. Now, Byron is a healer, right? But Willow isn't a damage healer. She's a controller brawler. So I think it's fair to say that her damage is a bit on the strong side. Also, her gadget can help her overcome a lot of matchups that she would normally struggle against because she can deal a lot of damage instantly with it. Like it's almost 3000 damage and that is a lot in one instant hit right next to Willow. For her utility score, I'm going to give her a nine out of 10. I think that her star power is very strong because it decreases the reload speed of anyone who is taking damage from her attack. And although I didn't really like point it out too much in today's gameplay, that makes a huge difference. Also, her super adds a lot of utility that I haven't even come close of being able to fully explore yet. I, I really think that I need a lot more practice with her, which when a new brawler first comes out, I don't necessarily feel like I need a ton of practice with them. But with her, yeah, I need to practice with her because it's very unique. And her super is very difficult to aim and actually has a short range, which usually means that Willow is left in a dangerous position, even if she does hit an enemy with it. Now, it did take me a while to figure that out and to start actually playing around that. And a player's skill is gonna be really useful in determining whether or not to use her super and when to use it and when it's gonna be safe and not to. But I'm afraid that a lot of the time, the answer is going to be wait until later to use it because it's too dangerous for her a lot of times. As for her ease of use, I'm going to give her a four out of 10. I think that she has a lot of depth because of her super. But even if you do land your super on your opponent, what you do with the enemy brawler is very complex. Do you waste ammo and run away? Do you waste ammo and run towards your teammates? Do you go and fall back and attack their teammates and waste their ammo that way? Like there's, there's so many different things and it's gonna depend on a lot of different situations. Obviously in Brawl Ball, she's a very obvious choice because her super can be used as the ultimate defense and it can be used on an enemy brawler who's defending and carrying the ball and just then walk it in like like it's really good and after playing her for just an hour I honestly feel like I'm just beginning to scratch the surface for her super which I feel like it's a pretty impressive for somebody that's been playing Brawl Stars for like five years now right and another part of what makes her complicated is her survivability which I'm gonna give her a four out of ten as well she does not have a lot of HP she can't easily escape brawlers she doesn't have a way to heal herself and she really struggles to deal damage fast enough to anyone who does get close to her now she does have a gadget that can help her in those situations, and she does also have a super that can be used in close range combat, but even that's not a guarantee because it leaves her completely motionless and vulnerable while on the field. At that point, she can easily get sniped or attacked from behind a wall because other throwers actually counter her whenever she uses her super, and it's unlikely that she's gonna be able to use her super on another thrower because they're gonna be hiding behind a wall and her super does not travel through walls. With all that said, I do think that she's very fun and worth getting. Even if she's kind of weird to play, she she is super fun and in the hands of a skilled player, I think that she's gonna be very devastating. She might even be an A tier or possibly even an S tier brawler, not like high S tier, but low S tier brawler in the hands of the most competitive players. Now, let's say you don't have a bunch of mythic brawlers unlocked and you're trying to decide between Willow and some other mythic brawlers. Well. I think that I would pick Jean, Max, and Gray over Willow. And I think that she's about on an even playing field with Byron, Squeak, or Gray. In fact, Gray might be a little bit better than her. I would definitely recommend unlocking Willow over Mr. P, Terra, and Mortis. And if we're taking a look at all the different throwers in the game, I would recommend upgrading Sprout, Grom, and Dynamite first. But I would definitely upgrade Willow before I upgraded Tick or Barley. Keep in mind that for these recommendations, this is for most players and it's not for everyone. I think that there are plenty of very super skilled players who are, who are watching this video that are even better than I am and will be able to unlock Willow's true potential in their hands 
Willow might be too strong, but for most players, I think that she's slightly above average and a very fun brawler to play either way. If you're going for fun, she's really unique and quirky, and I really like that. And she, you know, unique and quirky, not like Mandy is, where she's kind of clunky and weird to play, but like actually fun to play. Either way, I want to know what you guys think of Willow, so let me know in the comment section below, and make sure you subscribe for future content, or you can check out some of my previous videos right here if you haven't already. For now, this is Kairos. I'm ticking by, and we will see you in Brawl Stars.